So Goldilocks and the Three Bears. That's what I like to call this part. Um, in, so I started researching, and re I read probably every article about independent medical practice that there was back in 2011, because there were only like this many to read. Um, try that now, you can't. So I came across um, a doctor named Gordon Moore, and in 2001, he started an independent medical practice, or an ideal medical practice, otherwise known as IMP. He had a staff of one. It was himself. He did the scheduling, the doctoring, the lab draws. He did everything. And um, so I thought, that sounds pretty cool. But being the extrovert that I am, I would have gone absolutely crazy being alone with no coworkers or no colleagues to talk with. So that pot of porridge was a little bit too cold for me. Um, kept looking. Guess who I found? Q Lions. Uh, Med Lion. Brian Forrest Group. That was back in the day. Um, these people were pretty brilliant. They're, I call them entrepreneurs with a medical degree. They saw the value in creating a practice model that would benefit them greatly and bring them great success. Um, they love to grow and grow quickly. But for me, I still wanted some autonomy. So for that, that was too hot for me. That's not quite the right pot of porridge. Now, Clint Flanagan is doing an excellent job at Nextera as a business entrepreneur. So where do we go? DPC lifestyle model. So as you'll see, those Rob Lamberts, Sharon McCoy George, and Ryan Newhoffel. Those are the next people I came across in the journey. Um, and I, I contacted each of them, and they were, I think they were all sort of surprised and a little bit flattered that anyone even knew who they were and what they were doing. And um, I thought they were pretty brilliant. They're on these their own little islands of entrepreneurial insanity. And um, it was so exciting to talk to them. And I drank the Kool-Aid, and I found my pot of porridge. This was like the perfect place I wanted to be. Um, so on July 9th, 2012, I opened my own practice in Denver. Um, and we've been open five years now. Practice is full with a pretty long waiting list, so no marketing needed.